Very interesting. So this will be the second upload for <clears throat> Taurus. There's definitely a, reconcil a reconciliation happening for you from someone coming in the past. Spirit is saying it's safe for you to love this person. They're asking you to keep an open mind. You're being called to uh, learn all the things from your past. If you are seeing this reading and you haven't checked out the first reading make sure to check out the first reading for Taurus okay um it's this is saying it's safe for you to love when this person comes back in you're gonna have to discuss your truth with this person um the truth should flow openly and honestly <clears throat> this person may also um be one to speak some things about the past some things that may keep this person trapped may have something to do with the same sex here for some of you this person wants you to keep an open mind as they speak their truth here why is aquarius here for teach and learn for what is blocking taurus from moving forward All right. So I feel like here, some of you have a mask on. You need to speak some sort of truth here. You may have fell in love with someone else. For some of you, you may have also um, used someone or been a part of a third party situation. So this is saying it's time for you to um, establish some boundaries here. Especially with uh, Saturn being up here in uh, present moment. Okay, this Saturn is here asking you to be realistic. Some of you are in succubus energy. Again, <clears throat> are you dealing with a high priestess or someone that did some sort of work with the siren being here? Okay, somebody could also see you as bad news here. Someone uh, likes, again, to speak their truth with sex, which is nothing wrong here. But I feel like for those of you that are having people do work on you, this person is doing work through sex magic. This person does not want you to ascend. Somebody may have ghosted someone also. Saturn, why is Saturn here? So is Stork. No, you hang up. So some, some, someone definitely may have lost a child or faked a pregnancy here somebody could definitely want to uh, reach out and speak some sort of truth make a date here somebody could also be have a fear of rejection this is somebody that you have been in a karmic cycle with or they see you as karmic or materialistic or mentally ma uh, manipulative or someone that just causes a lot of smoke and mirrors why is mercury here Mercury. Siren, yeah. This person causes a lot of mental uh, manipulation, whether if it's male or female. Okay, so this person may also be obsessed here. You're dealing with someone that is obsessed with causing a lot of confusion. Um, someone is obsessed with trying to uh, keep a partnership, so, you know, Someone is mad at the way someone loves someone else. Now that could be happening to you, Taurus, <clears throat> or this could be for some of you, a Taurus. Okay. Why is the 12th house here for dedicated effort? So some of you, this is someone in your circle, a friend, Someone you thought was a friend. Paradise coffin. Yep. So this this person was trying to hide their dislike for you. This person also may have gossiped a lot about you. They have a secret obsession for you. It's really interesting. Oh. This person is not, not sorry about their actions. That's what I'm saying. I feel like this... Um, Somebody's dealing with somebody that's mentally ill. Somebody may also have a third party into their situation. This person may have been very attractive. They could also have been an Aries. <clears throat> so 
someone very manipulative, male or female. This person likes to taste, take risks. They like also being a third party in a situation. This is someone that will lie to your face. They will definitely take the risks. And for some of you, it's a bride. Okay. Somebody did not uh, want a partnership to end. Oh. The Phoenix, yep. In reverse. New phase. We can't, what is that? Rekindle. Renew. Oh, yeah, just basically what I said. This bride did not want a new beginning. <clears throat> this also this person could also have been doing binding spells to keep from keep someone from being a bride. Yep. They do it in secrecy. This person doesn't realize they're self-sabotaging their self. The more that they work on other people's relationships, the more theirs don't work out. And now their money is really <clears throat> not working out as well. This person may also be into the same sex. It's safe for you to love. This is a very interesting reading right here. Must say that. Ooh, okay, so sunglasses. Very, 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 very. Some of you, some of you, this is weird. Okay, so somebody that does magic or some sort of spells to get people, to get men. This is someone very attractive. They possibly do money manifestation spells and stuff like that. Okay, so <laughs> I feel like they got with somebody that was a peeper, somebody that liked to put on sunglasses. <laughs> okay, and peep, like, I don't know, it's like weird. Okay, with the dragonfly. <laughs> it's saying it's time for you to heal. Okay, so somebody definitely was dealing with somebody that was a peeper. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Some of you may have went on a date. This could be coming up. Okay. <laughs> For some of you, it might be a Scorpio. I'm just saying. Not all Scorpio. I'm just saying. Okay. But they might have Scorpio on their chart somewhere with the Green <laughs> With the Green Reaper. <laughs> Somebody has like real, real bad taste in their mouth about dating because somebody would peep over their sunglasses i don't know i mean this is person somebody is very picky that's why the six house is here very virgo energy this kid <laughs> somebody was dealing with a, a virgo that i could just see this person at a club this is somebody that <laughs> attracts a lot of people when they're out okay but it's not relationship uh, material okay so some of you may those of you so those of you that are on a low vibration <laughs> ew, i'm sorry this is not this is not high vibrational love energy this is for those of you that have been working mm-hmm and you may have had some challenging times with dates, but your finances is okay. Or you are a high priestess or sorcery, or you're doing some F stuff, right? And it's all bad. That's all, all I can say. All right, so I'm being told to get one of these. Show me what it is. We had the distorted feminine energy this could also be distorted masculine energy with the unknown this person does not know all their unions are toxic at this point it's time for you to do some sort of pilgrimage others of you be mindful of who you shake hands with for those of you who are going into a new business this is definitely a warning for you okay with the queen being here whether if you male or partner uh, male or partner male 
or female. Okay, people will try to drain your energy by touching you. Be mindful of partnerships here. Somebody is also trying to do magic. If you are a male watching this. <sighs> yeah. Somebody feels betrayed, backstabbed. They're doing ritualistic work, candle magic, sex magic, possibly finance magic. For some of you, it's somebody you have a child with or a child's mother. All right. Like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you share. If you'd like to book with me, remember, I do use uh, my discretion. All right. I'll see y'all later.